cold right now. Around the little froze. Just getting after it. First time this year. Temperatures on them out. kind of deal here, flat set. different than early November. Almost at Christmas. Everything's a little hard. Coming off a cold streak. Dry dirt. Maybe this summer. paper. Keep the dirt from going under my trap. first. Starting to look for mates this time of year. That's where I want his nose to go. Can his feet will fall. Looking to pee. And that's it. Maybe have a red there tomorrow, not a gritter. Uh -huh. All right, our second spot in the morning. Um, we've got to set a couple coon sets in here. We got a cuff, nice bright white one, so they can see it. Setting a little travel way here between two cut corn fields. Seen some tracks going through it, so we're gonna get one of these cuffs in here. A nice, nice heavy log to anchor it to. A little gnarly so it can't they can't slide it off. Cinch it down tight on it. Get these guys set. Make it pretty easy.
got a little bit of pet food. Stick a little down in. <laughs> nice bright golf ball to put on top, keep the smaller stuff from pulling the food out. Smear it on your log. Yeah. Do it don't out there. Yeah. It'll still bring them over. And that's all there is to it. Make the coon trapping pretty easy. Drop down to the water for this set, getting back to the basics, putting in a pocket set. Looks like a little bit of a trail right here. Just kick the pocket into the bank with my boot. I don't know, eight, ten inches back from the bait. Up and out of the water, stays a little stinky. Just got some trout mash put in the back. Get that up in there. bed out in front of the out in front of the pocket there get it seated nice and flat keep a couple inches of water over it it's cold and cold night yet so it doesn't freeze over top and we put some banana rama and plum loco at the last two so we'll go with something a little fishy for this one Set in yesterday, and uh, we got a nice red, real prime, late December. It's just a toe or two. second morning here and doing a check and you see a nice red in this set yesterday big male looks like I got a female today well, here's a one of Kyle's coon sets over here at this big hollow tree looks like they were going in it and they're crap it on it and it was a little bit about 10 15 degrees warmer last night and coon are running probably a little bit more you can see him in there but trying to hide behind the tree I guess what are you doing yeah Oh, 
nice set in the cuff. We'll take care of him and go check a few more yet. Well, we're coming down to the other set we got here. This little ditch that runs down on this field. And picked up a big one here. Nice looking coon. Late December. Absolutely prime as can be. It's a nice one. Got him by both front feet. <laughs> He's a nice big one. Right about 50 yards downstream from where we just had that other one. So, a 10, 15 degree warmer night. Brings them around. Plus Kyle's not here, of course. This is when we'll get everything and I'll have to carry it all. We come this morning down in the spot last night and you can see the coon were busy last night. A nice big one right here. You can tell. Big old boar. Nice one. And we just put a, I'll just put a set over here yesterday. Put another set in since we're coming down here. And here you can see he's got another one. Doubled up on him here. That was a new set. Just put that one in. Yesterday it's good we did. Now I gotta carry him out. This is a real nice boar here. Big boy. Well, here's the morning run. Just running a few traps. I don't know, might have 10 sets out of each or so for coon and fox. But, um, not bad. I said earlier it was warmer tonight last night so the coon were out and the big boars there's three real nice big boars there and fox are prime the coon are prime a couple days before Christmas and so you know the fur's good and the leather's good the prices are down this is the time to get them because you want to get the best stuff that's the only stuff that sells so uh, See what we get tomorrow. It's going to be another warm night t tonight, I believe, so the coon should be out again. Oh, here. Coming up on a pocket set. Kyle made the other day. And uh, so we got a nice coon in it. Number one and a half. He was working the pocket there and got himself stuck. Nice looking coon. Well, we're back over here at this set again. And you can see we're uh, three for three on this one. It's been a good location. Usually once you get one, you can pick a few more up. This one looks like a young male. He's got a blocky head. So we got a good catch on them. Uh, we'll take care of this one. <laughs>